Hi, my name is Dima Hamdan. I'm a filmmaker and I'm here to talk about my first feature film project which is entitled The Kidnap. It is a crime thriller set in Jordan and it's the story of Hassan who's a very important, very powerful man in the Jordanian police force. His wife is pregnant with their first baby but one day before she's due to give birth she gets kidnapped. Now the kidnappers, they don't call him, they don't ask for a ransom and he has 24 hours to look for her in secret before the family finds out. And that's when Hassan realizes that this is not about money, this is an act of revenge. Somebody has kidnapped his wife to get even with him for something really bad that he did 20 years ago. So Hassan can't win. He can either save himself or save his wife and the baby. We are here in one of the locations. This is potentially the most important location in the film because this is where the kidnappers bring the pregnant wife and they hold her hostage. Now, geographically, we're in an area called Wadi Shaib, which is just outside the town of Salt. And this is an abandoned house, which is very much how I'd imagined um, the place would be when I first started writing the kidnap. Imagine that this structure has stood still in time for 20 years and the importance of this place is that this is also the location where Hassan hid some very bad secrets from 20 years ago so basically the kidnappers are bringing him back to the past to confront what he'd done and the significance or you can say the symbolism of this place that outside the urban, crowded, claustrophobic sprawl of Jordan or Amman. If you want to take care of business, if you want something hidden away from the prying eyes of the people, you want something to be done in secret, this is the place. Now, the idea for the kidnap uh, came from an investigative piece that I did as a journalist. Um, I did something about illegitimate children in the Arab world and how they get dumped and thrown in orphanages because you simply cannot have an illegitimate child in a household. And the story as a journalist always felt incomplete because there they were, those children in the orphanage, and I kept wondering what happens to them when they grow up. What kind of people do they become? And do they have a right to be vengeful and hateful and come back and get even with those who did so much injustice towards them? And this is what the kidnap is about. It's not about passing judgments. It's not about labeling things with right or wrong or good or bad. The starting point is simply this. We have high moral values in society. We talk about honor and we talk about pride, but is it worth committing really ugly crimes in the name of such morals. And if we do that, are we prepared for the consequences? How far are we willing to go to protect our own ground? Uh, the script is very much ready to be shot right now. We have won two development awards from Abu Dhabi. We've won another development award from Sweden. We are a Jordanian-French co-production. We have four very talented actors confirmed. We are already scouting for locations. And uh, basically, this is the kind of film that people really want to see. It touches on themes that everybody from the world, from around the world can, can relate to, even if they are not from this particular culture. It is a film that I hope will resonate with the young generation, not just in Jordan, but in the Arab world as a whole. And we are very excited because the project is just slowly coming together. And what would really help is if we get crowds of people helping us with the money. It's not about how little you contribute. Crowdfunding is about lots of people coming in and just putting in whatever they can. And every penny you give to us will go straight into the production. It will go into the shooting of the film. We have been developing for two years. We are ready. And with your assistance, hopefully we'll be shooting very soon. Thank you.